Huh? Who sneezed? A clue, a clue! A clue. You see our last clue. Where's it? Oh, our last clue. And it's on that sound. A sneezing sound. Sneezing must be the last clue to where Blue is. Nice work, detectives. All right, you know what we need, our handy dandy. Notebook! Notebook, right. So, sneezing. For sneezing, we'll draw the mouth like this. A curved line here to make the lips, and some curvy lines like these, for the sound of sneezing. There, sneezing. Hey, we have all three clues to figure out where Blue is. You know what that means, we're ready to sit in our golden thinking chair. Thinking chair. Let's go. Okay, now that we're in our golden thinking chair, let's think. So, we need to figure out where blue could be. And our clues are, Sarah. A spoon. And, this sneezing sound. So where do you think Blue could be with these clues? Well, what if Blue found Sarah? And maybe, Blue would use the spoon. That's a good guess. But to do what with it? Soup, right. Blue could use the spoon to feed Sarah some soup. But what about the sneezing sound? Well, maybe Sarah could be making the sneezing sound. Oh yeah. Maybe that's what the soup is for. So, if Blue was using this spoon to feed Sarah some soup, and she was making that sneezing sound, what would that mean? Sniffles. Sniffles. Oh, oh that's it. You're right. Sarah must have the sniffles. Yeah, the sniffles. I had them once. I had them too. Yeah. So, Blue, must have helped Sarah's family, make some soup in the kitchen, and she's feeding Sarah some soup, with the sniffles. <coughs> How thoughtful of her. We just figured out Blue's clues. We just, figured out, Blue's clues. We just, figured out, Blue's clues. We just, figured out, Blue's clues. Because you're really smart. Bark, 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 bark.